Not everything is what it seems. Small decisions make up great outcomes. That shot that hit the post in the last minute, the goal the referee allowed even though it was a clear offside, reality could be different. And it is, here in La Liga, upside down. The derby was decided by a lonely goal scored by Benzema. But Real Madrid were far from being the best team in the pitch. Zidane went with his five-player midfield once again, but Simeone countered him with a splendid press, which pushed the Frenchman to make two subs at halftime. Vinicius was one of them and was key to harness the victory, but not in La Liga upside down. Because Atletico Madrid had an excellent first half and made a great impression at Bernabeu, Ángel Correa was the most dangerous player for the Colchoneros and had two clear chances. One ended up hitting the outside of Courtois post, but the other one would be Atletico's equalizer in La Liga upside down. Setien changed his system against Levante in hopes of a victory that would help him straighten his poor first month as Barca's head coach. He was able to win the match with two goals from Ansu Fati, but the image of the team was erratic once again. Even if their first half was impressive, things leveled off in the second half, and Levante could have very well taken a point from Camp Nou, which is exactly how things went in La Liga upside down. The Granotas pushed a lot in the last 45 minutes, and their captain Morales would manage to score a goal that would ultimately allow them to tie the match 2-2. Morales managed to beat Ter Stegen, who's usually the hero for Barca. But in this game, he would miss on both Morales and Rochina's equalizing goals. La Liga upside down continues to have Real Madrid and Barcelona fighting for the title. But this dimension knows no mercy. When they get undeserving victories in real life, things get corrected in this parallel reality. It's just the way things go in La Liga, upside down. Ya que nos encontraste, no nos pierdas. Suscríbete a nuestro canal de YouTube de Telemundo Deportes.